So, um, we recently had a, a scooper here online, you know, the V scooper. And, you know, you always got to be careful when you're talking about scoopers and whatnot. But even this scooper recently uh, put out an entire thread uh, uh, of his verified scoops. Uh, there's more. I, I saw him post them earlier, but he's showing the proof of, of his, uh, of his previous scoops that got confirmed. Like here, he had a scoop for like Insidious 5 that came out months ago. And then he like confirmed it and all that. So he's, he's proven his track record and I have seen him get some stuff right. Right. So then I was looking at, uh, at something he recently talked about, and this is the rumored plot. He was letting us know, uh, Oh geez, what the heck, uh, for, um, uh, for the upcoming Jurassic Park movie. Why is it going off to the side like that? Whatever. Okay, so this is what he said. Jurassic Park, which right now, remember, we have it currently rumored as Jurassic City. That's the rumored plot, the rumored title. We'll see if they stick with it. But they say here, a rescue team ver ventures into an island ruled by dinosaurs to save scientists. The main hero to be a John Wick-inspired character, a hybrid human dinosaur serum is uncovered at the end. Focused on action and visuals. Nothing definite yet. Honestly, all those rumors right there, although sounding a bit sketchy, seem perfectly in line with what we've been hearing about with this new um, Jurassic Park movie. Because, yeah, they tried to get David Leach. And David Leach literally was... Let me see if I can pull him up. Uh, David uh, Leach uh, movies. He literally directed uh, a, a John Wick a movie like it's in his resume he's done it before where is it you're just gonna have to believe me it's it's there guys okay what not but and i was like oh like that resume just didn't scream uh freaking see john wick director there there's your proof if you don't want to believe me but i was like dude that guy that uh, john wick director for jurassic park that just doesn't seem right dude but now we know why the main character in the movie is gonna be a john wick inspired character I thought Owen Grady, maybe he wasn't John Wick, but he was that cool, suave boy. He was the I-can-do-anything guy, right? He was the guy who could control dinosaurs with the palm of his hands. He could do anything. Like, I, I rarely ever saw Owen Grady fail in the Jurassic Park series. But not to give, like, a John Wick-inspired... What, what is it going to be, like, Jason Statham in The Meg? That's what I picture. He's, oh, The Meg. So i will going to punch a dinosaur. It's a terrible Jason Statham impression, but I'm thinking, is that what's going to happen in here? I do kind of like the idea of a rescue team venturing onto an island. That definitely screams back to basics Jurassic Park, although all the movies deal with a character going to an island there. I still kind of like that setup. I feel like that's what a lot of people were missing from Fallen Kingdom when a big chunk of the majority of that movie just took place either on the boat or in the mansion. And it's like, well, I want to be on an island full of dinosaurs. Um, so I do like that. Now, the hybrid dinosaur human uh, detail. I don't know if I believe that. Yeah, see, like, see, I, I call BS. I call BS. I don't know, man. I don't know because, like, in a weird way, you have that little girl, so, uh, what was it, um, Jurassic, uh, World Little Girl, I forget her name, is it Macy, Maisie, the clone girl, uh, her, I mean, she, I thought they were gonna do way more interesting things with her, like, she was such an interesting idea thrown into Jurassic World, right, she was a clone, they used the same science they did to clone and create dinosaurs, but they did it on a human, Who's to say there isn't some, I don't know, weird dinosaur DNA in her and she's the key to like some human hybrid type of thing. Uh, I, I kind of believe it and we know they've tried to do it before, right? Jurassic uh, Park um, human hybrids. Like that was an idea for a while for the fourth movie before it became Jurassic World with Chris Pratt and everything. They wanted to do it. And yes, I agree. It's definitely a crazy, super out there idea. Dude, if somebody can do it right. And if that's what you're wanting to lean into with the Jurassic Park franchise is just to be an action series now instead of the horror elements, okay, I'm down. I mean, there could be some horrifying thing in there. What if the serum can turn a human into a dinosaur? Just think about, like, the body dis body morph transformation of that. Like, you're a regular guy, and you get hit with Tyrannosaurus Rex, and you're turn into the dad from Step Brothers. I lost the touch. <laughs> Please no one clip that. <laughs> But I was like, okay, I, I don't know. Like, I even saw this. Because he, he did also mention that before, the V-Scooper. He mentioned that uh, the that they would maybe include uh, 
the robotic stuff in there. Oh, dang, I can't look it up. What is it called? The V Scooper. Let me see if I can he, find it real quick. Jurassic. Uh, da, 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 da. I know he's he's posted about it. Okay, yeah, he said this long. This was also something he said before they announced this new movie. So that's why it makes me feel like he's credible because he said they're about to announce a new movie, and then two months later they do. He said Jurassic Park. Uh, new projects are coming for a movie and a series exploring different outcomes like mutated human, robotics, horror, and more. We should have news soon. And then, yeah, like a couple months later, we got the announcement. We're making a fourth movie and this and that. And so I was like, the robotics part. I never knew about that. But then I see this concept art of like robot dinosaur hybrid things. Maybe that's where they go with it. Like, could you imagine a robot dinosaur? That's kind of cool. I know it, it. it's starting to sound too out there and whatnot. But it's like, that's, that sounds kind of awesome to me. I don't, I don't know. So, hang on, let me put this, let's see here. Okay. Um, I, don't, I, that's what I'm hearing. I, it definitely isn't like the direction I would have loved them to go, but you know, John Wick dinosaurs. I do like the idea of a group of like military people going onto an island fighting dinosaurs. That alone, yes, please give that to me. You start wanting to play with, you know, human hybrid stuff, tease it at the end so it doesn't happen in this movie and then they explore it in the next. I'm, I'm willing to see where it goes. I'm willing to see where it goes. Dominion disappointed me so. <laughs> Uh, I'm just open to it, but we'll see. That that's just what we're hearing. Well, only time will tell what happens next there. So love to hear from you guys on what y'all think about that. Okay, let's move on to our next topic here, which is talking about Terrifier Three, which.